Good morning, world. Just started off the morning, and Winnie is gonna leave today, so she's visiting. I don't think I vlogged it the day that she came, but she came here to have like a girls' trip in Palm Springs with her girlfriends. And after that trip was over, she came and she hung out with me for like a day. So she's leaving today. Oh my god, it's too bright right here. We're just gonna move on over here because it's too bright over there. Okay, Winnie. It's gonna leave today, but we wanted to take her to Din Tai Fung. <laughs> Even though back at home she has one like near her house, but you guys know we love Din Tai Fung, so we're gonna go there for breakfast. Oh, cannot wait. Them green beans, those green beans, and that sea salt cream drink. Ooh, that's the plan so far as of today. And I got this new dress from Free People and it just came in, so let me give you an OOTD. I don't think people really do OOTDs anymore, but here's my outfit for today. Um, so it's this romper. It's a little shorter than I imagined. I thought it was gonna be a little longer, but it, it's fine. I'm not like super tall or anything, so it's not like, you know, the booties out or anything like that. So here it is, very cute little romper. It has like the floral details right here. And I just really like this color. It comes in actually a lot of shades. This one I have is like the dusty rose, I believe. It comes in like black, white, purple, like um, a pink or something. So I have it in the blush or like dusty rose color. As for my bag, I'm wearing my Foley Foley bag. They gifted this to me on the trip to Greece. And I don't know the name of this purse specifically, but it's the white one and I really like the clasp right here. So it's like a hook. So that's what kind of like scrunches this part of the bag together when you pull it in and then you hook it. Really cute and it's very spacious. I can fit a lot of things in here. I have my full size wallet. Oh, you know what? A lot of you guys asked me about this wallet. Give me a second. Here it is. This is my wallet. I've had it for, I believe over a year or so and the brand, Nunuko. I think it's like a, Oh, I don't even want to say because I'm probably not right, but uh, I think it's Australian or something uh, But you can go on the website. It's nunuco.com I believe and this is just their marble wallet. It's pretty inexpensive I think I got it for like 40 US dollars and um, it is vegan leather So I really like it and the gold rose gold hardware. It's really pretty uh, Overall, I would say the quality is pretty good. It's holding up pretty well There are parts of it. That's kind of you know shredding a little bit right here you can't really see but it's shredding a little bit here but it's really not a big deal i would say overall the quality is really good hey you look like security guard look. the skinniest one you'll see yes yeah. look at this all black earth thing <laughs> looking like a security guard <laughs> and i know you're dying in that because it's I so know, hot I today think it was so hot. <laughs> i had the ac on mm -hmm. so i was like oh it shouldn't be that bad yeah, it's bad today. Little did you know. Little did you know. That it was hot in the zoo, the zoo, the zoo, the zoo. We are trying out a, a new camera, right? Did you tell them? It's a new camera, but this is the G7X2. Oh, something my. But yeah, this is the G7X2. We are trying it out for the very, very first time. What's the focus? I feel like it's a pen. Okay. <laughs> This is really breakfast though, our first meal of ZZ. We slept in, we woke up at like 12. I know, last night you guys said, oh, I'm gonna wake up at 9. Nah. I, I woke up quite a few times this morning, but mm -hmm. I'm like, nah. Nah. Oh my lord. Her snoring was no joke. Oh. oh my goodness. What happened? Uh, it was just really loud. <laughs> Yeah. The way she stores, you even grind your teeth. Mm -hmm. She like oh. grinds your teeth and everything. I'm just like. It wasn't that long ago since the last time we were here. Um, the last time was. I think we vlogged it. We had it in the Chinese vlog channel. And uh, I'll link it right here if you guys can see it. Or is it this way? Maybe? Or maybe this way? Favorite drink? The sea salt cream uh, black tea. Really, really good. Nothing beats their string beans. Nothing. Not even my love for you. <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> it's so good. Let me try. My first time. Mm. Wow. Mm. If I had to describe our love, it would be this string bean. Mm -hmm. So good. So 
could describe it more other than it's like a string bean. It's very rich in flavor. So I love it's very it's rich, rich in flavor. <laughs> it's very rich in love. Mm. And um, it's very salty because you'd be salty about how I feel about Treso. Wow. I don't even care. <laughs> how is it? Is it good? So good, huh? What are you drinking? Uh, honey black tea by usual. Mm. Can I try it? Team, team. I think it's good. But you know, you don't like that. Oh, no, it's good. I feel like it's good when you're. Honey black tea hella hot. Mm -hmm. Honey is good for your throat, right? When it's yeah. Yeah. The honey, it's like good honey. It doesn't taste like cheap honey. <laughs> And that drink is amazing. I've tried other, um, the sea salt cream black tea. Give it to me. Ooh. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Oh, yummy. It's so good. Uh, you know one thing, thank you. One thing I like so much about this place is that it's consistent. The flavors, mm -hmm. every single time, it's like, it tastes the same. There's never really like a huge change because sometimes I go to different restaurants and I order a specific thing that I really like there, but it kind of changes every single time I go depending on the chef of the day. But here, every single time we've been here, it's on point. I think all our food came already. Fried rice cake over there, and then fried noodles over here, siu long bao, and then this is a uh, fish dumplings, fish dumplings. These are really, 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 really good. I like them because like they're not super fishy, which I really love. Nice Let's give them a, a test. What will her? Ooh. How did they do this? So I'm having Wall try things on for me. I'm trying to get my grandpa a birthday present and he loves denim jackets and he's literally Wall size so I'm trying to figure this out. I wish they had medium. Is that not a medium? What is that? No, it's a small one and then oh. they have large. Try the large then? I wish they had like extra medium. Extra medium. <gasps> he looks so funny in a denim jacket. I'm just, I'm just not used to this. this let me see, let me see. Oh yeah, that's too wide. Mm. I don't really like it. <laughs> the grandpa look, the grandpa oh, look. This is a little too big. Yeah, no, that's too big. All right. Looking at bed sheets here at Muji. This is great, right, y'all? This is great, but apparently, it's brown. Huh? <laughs> what? But it looks great to me. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get this because it's actually so soft. Look how Pinteresty this bed is right here. Well, if it was made, just picture if it was like a made bed, it's just like white and clean on like this wood platform. Yeah, it drew my attention. It drew my attention because the material feels so soft. It kind of reminds me of like um, the West Elm bed sheets, except this is so much more affordable. So I'm gonna grab some. Kind of. Actually, you know what? This is nice too. Maybe I'll get this. <laughs> All right. So this color it is, I guess. Winnie, what do you think? On my like my bedroom, do you feel like white is cuter or like this this uh, gray? White, yeah. It's just more like crispy clean, yeah. Okay, you're right, you're right. All right, I guess I'll do white. I totally forgot to vlog. Um, so basically, I came over to Benny's to work on some um, to work on some work. Even now, the dogs had such a blast. They had so much fun. Come here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> good girl. Oh, oh, oh. It's okay. It's okay. You're it's doing right. so good. Good girl. Good girl. Nami's like, first time in shoes. She's like, what is she's this? She's probably cussing us out in her head right now. Like, are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> my feet are perfectly fine. I know. She's like, oh, what is this? Look at her hind legs. I know. What, so look spread. at that. It's so <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. Okay, come on. You can do it. You can do it. Come on. Michi's like, oh, no big deal. I know, Michi's like the huge. <laughs> okay, Navi, come. Navi, come. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Oh, there you go. Good girl. Good girl. She's doing pretty good, actually. At least she's walking. Yeah. The first time I put him on money, money wouldn't even walk. She just froze. <laughs> At least she's trying. I know, they feel a little funny. 
Mishi, you might need to teach her um, how to walk in shoes. I know. New shoes for the girls today. Michi got a new pair. Uh, a smaller pair because the other ones were just a little too big. So there it is. We get it from Amazon. It's called My Busy Dog. That's the brand. And Navi has the same one. She just has it in orange. Oh, for reference, Navi is a size one and Michi is size two, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. So yeah, <laughs> if you guys have her, like, a dog around their size, that's the size reference. Hi. Are you guys sniffing each other? Are you guys talking about this? They're like, yeah, these darn parents putting shoes on us. <laughs> Alrighty. Alright, now let's do the harness. Oh my gosh, she's actually just walking around though. I love it. At least she's not frozen. <laughs> so we have red for Michi, orange for Navi. Wow. Okay, so you guys are so cute. Okay, in case you guys are new here and you're wondering why are we putting shoes on our dogs? No, it's not a fashion statement. It's two reasons. So one, the area we're in is really dirty, so we just like to put shoes on them to protect their feet from you know the germs and bacteria and all that. And then reason number two is it's getting really hot now, and as you guys know, the pavement gets really hot. And if you don't put shoes on your dog, you're like risking their paws, like you know, getting all burnt and. Um, I've actually seen a paw before that's like burnt from the the hot pavement and it's like raw So you don't want that happening to your dog So that's why we put shoes on them and a good tip I would say if you guys do want to try to do this um <clears throat> Well, excuse me a lot of people ask us like how do we like intro them to it you just have to put it on them at home and let them walk around with it like that right now <laughs> so like let them get used to it have them wear it at home come on, baby. Let's go. good girl <laughs> come here, come here. good girl so yeah over time let them get used to it wearing them at home and once they get better at it then just take them out and see how it goes <laughs> oh, I know it's so weird. Michi's like, I'm good. <laughs> Back home, and we are gonna have our leftover Thai food from last night. This is actually really good. Uh, we ordered from Flavors of Thai. I guess it's like this Thai restaurant around downtown area. I'm assuming I ordered it on. I think it was Postmates or something. Yeah. Uh, so so good. If it's this good and it's takeout, I can't imagine how good it is in the restaurant. So I'm gonna have to. Go to this restaurant one of these days and try it out. Mmm. Still so good even after a day. I look over. <laughs> and I see this. What do you want? You always make me feel guilty about eating. Hmm? Why do I always have to share with you? I mean, I love you, but... Do I have to share with you? Just because I love you? Huh? <laughs> good girl. Also drinking cranberry juice. How do you like this gourmet dinner I made for very you? Very gourmet. Yeah, very gourmet, huh? <laughs> it was really good last night. Though. Oh, come on! Um, it was so good last night. I know. It's actually still really good right now. So, enjoy.